What's up everybody? It's the Unknown Gamer Freak coming at you with another how-to video. This time we're going to be talking about the iPad. This is a cool little trick I found on Cydia that I thought I'd share with you guys. It's how to get an actual physical Bluetooth mouse to work with your iPad. Yes, an actual mouse cursor on your iPad. Let's get started. Alright guys, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up Cydia. Let that load. Once Cydia loads, we're going to go over to Sources, Edit, and Add a Source. And the source we are going to add, if it'll let me paste it, is igoldhouse.myrepospace.com. Again, that's igoldhouse.myrepospace.com. You're going to click Add Source. Once it's all installed, your sources, you're going to search for, let's see, BT Stack Mouse right there I have it open guys for you BT stack mouse you're gonna go over here of course it mine's already installed and you're gonna hit install once it is installed you are going to respring it'll automatically ask you to do that and then you will see on your iPad a new icon that says mouse so we're gonna open that up real quick now when you open this up I'm gonna open it real quick at the same time you're gonna to need to be turning on your your Bluetooth capable mouse so there we go I just flip mine on and there it goes guys I just found it John Lockhart's mouse, that's mine. I'm going to click it. You see it's there, it's connecting. Um, should only take a few seconds here, guys. Alright, guys, there it is, it's connected. Um, here's a little bit of uh, options you can do right there. You can go to your settings and actually configure how it works, whatever. Uh, I've already got mine the way I want it, so let's go back to the home screen. Let's see if this thing works. There it is, guys. You actually have a physical mouse. Look at that, isn't that crazy? So that, that, that's, that's all it is. And like I said, you just go to your settings. Let's go over here to settings. And mouse right there. And you can choose, you know, how touchy you want it to be and how non touchy. Um, here's all the settings for it, guys. Like I said, it's super easy. Uh, other than that, guys, that's how you get a Bluetooth mouse to work on the iPad. We'll see you again next time, guys.